Good afternoon, Beach Bums. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to South Florida. Today's the last day of fishing, and I've actually been fishing most of the day. We started this morning, me and Brad. We hit several different spots, several different locations. The fishing has been incredibly tough overall for this trip, but we just have not been able to get on consistent bites whatsoever. These fish are just not on the beaches. We have spent so much time fishing the beaches and this last cold front has dropped the water temp so much we are just not seeing any fish on the beach which really stinks. Brad is over there working on snook. He's trying to catch some more snook right now. I'm on the beach. Uh, there are some birds hanging around. I'm hoping that they'll start diving on some baits. Maybe get some blue fish running through here. I don't know. I'm throwing a spoon. Got a big spoon on my bummy stick and I'm just trying to get into whatever I can. Maybe, maybe get lucky and get a snook. I know they'll eat a spoon. I've got the Halco Twisty. This is a two ounce. I've got a quick clip and I've got 50 pound mono for my leader. Look at all the seashells. There are seashells everywhere. This is the seashell capital of the world. There are a lot of birds. They're mainly just sitting. But every so often, I do see them pick up and start diving. I think there's one school of bait moving around out there. So maybe there's some predator fish chasing that school of bait around. But I'm kind of hoping as we get later into the evening, fish will push in and push a little closer to the beach. I'm walking back to the car. I need to get my small rod with the paddle tails because I saw a redfish and a lot of bait up close to the beach. A snook was just chasing it. A snook chased it in. He didn't bite though. I don't know if I should change to a bucktail. I've got the paddle tail on, but a snook was right on it. All the way up to the beach. There's a lot of bait up close to the beach. I changed over to a bucktail. I had a paddle tail on and had a snook chase it all the way to the beach see if this will get a reaction. There's a fish. Oh, a little lady fish. Not desired species here. Especially after seeing a redfish and having a snook chase me up. He's pooped all over me. See you, buddy. There's a fish. There's a fish. Ah, oh, dang it. There's a little snook right here. Let's see if I can get him interested. He's not spooking. But he's not interested either. The little guy. Hmm. It's good to see him on the beach though. This is the first time I've seen the snook on the beach. There's a fish. There's a fish. What do we got? Come here. Little lady. Plenty of those. Oh, there's another snook. My goodness. These little snook are just not interested. Maybe I need to switch back to the slam shade. At least had one chasing it in. This is the first day I've seen any snook on the beach. I'm getting wrecked by ladyfish. Just constant little 
tiny ladyfish. That's all that I can manage to get bites. I'm seeing so many sheep's head. It's really interesting. There are a ton of sheep's head on the beach, but mixed in with the sheep's head are a little snook. And I saw a redfish with one of them. There's a lot of bait right by the beach. And these fish seem to be kind of hanging with it. I've seen three or four snook now just laid up next to the beach. They seem very dormant. They're not reacting at all to my lure. They're not even spooking. They're just easing away from it. Not showing any interest. I had that one snook chasing my paddle tail. Curious if I should maybe switch back to it. Okay, tons of bait just popped up. I've got the Slam Shady back on. That was a ladyfish. There's a fish. Another ladyfish. There are like a bazillion of these tiny little ladyfish. There he goes. Oh, 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 it's a snook. It's a snook. He followed it. I didn't get a good hook set. He didn't eat it good. Oh, first snook on the beach. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, got him. Heck yes. Stop it, stop it, stop it. On the slam shady. First snook on the beach and first beach artificial snook. Heck yeah, he is not big. I do not care. This has been a long time coming. It's been a tough trip to get these guys on the beach. That is so cool. I, I know it's not a big snook, but it is so fun coming out here. They're such a beautiful fish. It's so cool catching them on the beach. We'll get them back. All right, buddy. See ya. Thank you. Whoo, that's so cool. I saw him come up and eat it. I saw him come up and eat it. That is so cool. What I was saying, that's the first snook I've caught on the beach this trip because we just have not been seeing them. Finally, this evening, I've started actually seeing them. Had one chase, got that one to eat. All my other beach snook have been on live bait. Thank you, Slam Shady. Getting it done on the beach. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a redfish or a black drum. Oh, 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 oh. Dang it, they spooked. I'm abandoning fishing the beach. I'm gonna move into the pass and see if some of these blue fish move in here like they did the other day. I didn't catch any, but they were some decent sized blue fish. So if I can end the day with maybe a couple of big blues, to get my first snook of the trip on the beach. Feel good about it, it's been tough. Literally have not been seeing any, period, on the beach whatsoever the few days we've been here. That cold front pushed them into the passes, into the bays, they were not out here. Last day we're here, finally things have warmed up, of course. Now they're showing up on the beach, go figure. Stuff's happening right here. Out here at the mouth of the pass, let's see. Oh, they're blowing up. There's another. Woo! They're so acrobatic. <laughs> oh, oh, that was a big blow up. What was that? What was that? Something big blew up behind it. That might have been a jack. There we go. We'll try to get rid of this guy. That was like a big jack or something that came out of the water behind these guys. There he goes. Uh, bigger lady fish than what we've been catching. We'll get them back. <clears throat> Dang. These ladies are fired up. <clears throat> There's got to be a bluefish mixed in here. Got to be. Yeah, that's another ladyfish. They're so big. They're like micro tarpon. There you go. Can you get back? 
Can you do it? Can you do it? <clears throat> there you go. Why can't all fish just be like ladyfish? Like, they're gonna freaking eat. I was hoping to pull a blue out. Even if they were here, I don't think you can get past the ladyfish. 